the New York Giants get a B for me. Barkley and Hernandez uh, are pretty good picks. I like the Hernandez pick in the second round more than uh, Barkley in the first round. I, you know, I mean, I you know, have that whole take a running back later kind of uh, philosophy. Uh, and obviously Kyle Laletta seems like a solid pickup in round four. But you know, I, whether Laletta is there or Davis Webb uh, is there, I'm not really sold uh, on either of those two being Eli Manning's potential backup. I think that if Gettleman were to get a franchise quarterback after Eli is done, he'd get one in a brand new draft or in the actual first round. Um, uh, Eli technically has not shown any signs of aging. I think that Gettleman, along with you know, in cahoots with Eli Manning, uh, will feel that, oh, um, Eli is not 50 years old yet. And I guess once he looks like he's 50 or literally is 50, then we'll get his successor. I mean, you know, I, you know, again, as I talked about with the Saints, getting a, a quarterback of the future is also like getting a quarterback in the present because if your starter goes down and you need somebody uh, to fill in his place, relying on your incumbent players will not work. And, um, and I think that, you know, I think that maybe the Giants will, should, you know, try to figure out, they have to figure out a way to get Loletta and, uh, and Davis Webb reps. I think that, you know, I think that maybe it's not going to happen this year because Manning has to learn a new offense under Pat Shermer and Mike Shula. However, uh, I think that, you know, like, you know, having Manning, you know, not, p- probably play not till the third game just so that Webb and and Lola can get more acclimated would not be a bad idea for the Giants considering that Manning uh, has a body that is uh, getting older um, in addition to uh, in addition to all those issues I wish that they would, could have gotten a center I didn't agree with them letting Weston Richburg or uh, Justin Pugh go hmm and that's just me. I think that they're not going to get much for Eric Flowers anyway, and therefore um, the offensive line will still be a problem. Well, in the long run, I you know I I have a good feeling about the team, especially with Gettleman leading the way. Uh, but obviously they uh, obviously they have to you know have a, a great future in place. They have to have great picks for the future. Otherwise. The Giants fans and the media will actually miss Jerry Reese calling the shots for the team.